Mario Vitale was a mogul. He was the creme de la creme of our industry. There was a charm about his energy that people really wanted to be around him, but there was also a dark side to it too. Mario was funny, he was jovial, until he had too much to drink. The more he drank, the more sloppy and handsy he got. We called him the Red Menace. He felt entitled to do whatever the f he wanted to do. There was this known thing among the surfers. Don't stand too long next to Mario. He would hug you or kiss you or put his hands around your waist. And he had his tongue in my ear. He reached his hands down into my pants underneath my underwear and grabbed my ass. The boys club of high-end chefs is still very powerful. The people that were in power they were just shaking it off like, oh, it's another Mario incident. Don't worry about it. 70% of women that work in the restaurant industry say they have been sexually harassed. That's far higher than any other industry. So many of the women were so afraid. It's like, what am I supposed to do? I make $13 an hour. I needed that job and they don't give a f There was a real blacklist with him and it was terrifying. I was afraid of him. When someone rises to a certain level of celebrity, they become untouchable.